know that next year will be Ten Hag closed in on 27-year-old as replacement for outgoing 20 million pound star report. Dean Henderson looks unlikely to be warming the bench at Manchester United next season. The 25-year-old looks set to start last season as United number one, but about of long COVID mean he missed out on the start of the season. This allowed David Dajia a chance. To restart his claim for the spot, and he took that chance with open arms, putting in one of the best seasons of his career that won him the Player Player of the Year award. This left a disgruntled and ambitious Henderson languishing on the sidelines. A January loan deal was denied, further protesting the White Happen Man. United now looks set to finally allow the England hopeful to leave, with a deal with newly promoted Nottingham Forest said to be close. According to transfer guru Fabrizio Romano, the only holds up to the deal the eventual option to buy figure, which has been negotiated around the £20 million mark. Romano say that the option could be left out of the deal are together making a strike loan. Unite will pay a portion on his wages. With Leeds Grant also having left this month, this leave just from Hilton as backup to Duga at the club. And according to the athletic Lauris Whitwell, the club is in two minds as to whether they'll think the 36-year-old will provide enough cover on whether they suit Walter. Tom Hilton is talk more than capable of stepping up as number two, but United might step into the market with Watford Daniel Batchman under consideration at a cost of between two million pounds and four million pounds with Phil Climbs. The twenty seven year old is back up to former Red Ben Foster at Watford and has played 41 games at the Courage Road. The Hornets litigation means that they will begin to reduce the wage bill, meaning that the Austrian should be available at a cut-down price. <laughs>